All right, hey AP Chemistry, I wanted to just give you your quick setup for the Cheetos experiment. It's not gonna be like a lab test that you're typing into. You're gonna have data table that you're just gonna fill out and you're gonna answer some post-lab calculations and that's gonna be a separate grade. Um, now, the setup is here, but I wanted to show you what it's gonna look like for our lab. So you can kind of see that I have a ring stand here and every lab bench has a ring stand. There's an O-ring, I don't know if you could kind of see it, but there's an O-ring here that you are gonna put together and put on the ring stand. Right here's the O-ring. You're gonna put it on the stand. Um, I also have a beaker of water and there's a thermometer in the beaker of water. Now you could hold it or you could, if you have like another clamp that you could find in the drawer, you could just have it clamped on top of the water. And right now my water is reading a 20.9 degrees Celsius. What you're eventually gonna do is you're also gonna get a rubber stopper that has a hole in it. Um, you can't really see that. And we're gonna pretend like this pencil is the Cheeto. Um, there's copper wire that you're gonna poke into the Cheeto because it's crunchy and like you're able to get it into there. Um, you're gonna poke into the Cheeto and then make sure it stays in the copper wire. And then you're gonna put it right into the rubber stopper. Now just be careful, make sure that you're able to have it in the rubber stopper that it'll stay standing still up because what's gonna eventually happen is you're gonna put this Cheeto, let's pretend this orange pencil is my Cheeto, you're gonna put this Cheeto over a flame and it's gonna go on fire and then it's gonna burn, kind of like you're burning food in the body and as it's burning, it's gonna transfer heat into your water and change its temperature. So you're gonna follow the procedure exactly on how much water and what to do, but I just wanted to quickly show you. We are gonna use a Bunsen burner. So I'm gonna bring this over here for like a second. So I have the, the gas line on, but what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to light the, the lighter first and then turn on the gas. Don't turn on the gas first, otherwise we go boom. So I turn the light on and then I turn on the gas and I should have a flame. Boom, okay? You're only using this for a couple of seconds. You're just gonna put this over the flame until the pencil or your Cheeto, we're gonna be using Cheeto, is on fire and it's probably gonna smell really bad just because it's burning Cheeto. And now you're gonna transfer this flame that I have here underneath to the water. And you gotta make sure that your beaker, it's kind of, it's gonna be burning the water or it's gonna be adding energy to the water. You gotta make sure that this beaker is close enough to the flame. So you're gonna lower it a little bit. And it's a very small flame, but you're still transferring that heat energy and it's gonna smell really bad. And it's gonna transfer and smoke and it's gonna be adding energy to your water and you're going to wait until all of the cheeto burns as much as possible and get the temperature change so i'm going to turn that off and i'm going to also turn this off too okay luckily you'll be doing this with hopefully more than one person and you'll have other people making sure they ma maintain the flame you shouldn't leave that flame unattended it's going to burn um, in the procedure, you're going to get the mass of the Cheeto before you burn it and then the mass after on the balance. And you're going to write that in your data table. You're going to see how much of the Cheeto burned and you're also going to figure out how much energy that required because it transferred that energy to change the temperature of the water. And you're going to follow the post-lab calculations to do those steps. Okay? If you have any confusions or questions about this setup, make sure you ask me in class. Otherwise, I'm gonna leave you to burn Cheetos in class for today.